So a few months ago, I made a video on Toyota's internal combustion engine, and I was super excited because, well, number one, this technology could save the internal combustion engine, and number two, it sounded pretty damn cool. If you missed it, here's a clip of the 1.6 turbo hydrogen combustion powered Corolla. Well, Toyota just made me even happier. I could kiss you, Toyota. What did they do? Well, I'm guessing you read the title. That's why you clicked on the video. So, you know, they teamed up with Yamaha to create a 5 liter V8 hydrogen powered engine. Now, before we go into the details of this awesome engine, I just wanted to remind you what happens when Toyota and Yamaha join forces. <laughs> Yes, the Lexus LFA's 4.8 litre V10 was co-created by these companies and it was highly regarded as one of the best engines ever. So it's safe to say that they are a good team and that only good things can come from them pairing up. Now onto this new hydrogen powered V8 engine. So the engine they are using as a base to build it off of is the V8 out of the Lexus RCF. Now in its gas powered state. The 5 liter V8 produces 472 horsepower and 530 newton meters of torque, so it's pretty damn strong. But how strong is this engine when powered by hydrogen? Well, firstly, in order to convert the engine and keep as much power as possible, Yamaha modified the injectors, the head, and the intake manifold, and then they put on the coolest exhaust I have ever seen on an engine. I mean, look at it. How the hell is this thing gonna fit underneath the hood of a car? But damn, it looks cool. Anyways, in its hydrogen fuel powered state, it makes 444 horsepower and 540 Nm of torque, which is pretty close to its petrol powered engine. Now this really excites me. It's a performance V8 that will emit water vapor, so it will sound awesome and it will please the greenies. This is the future. This is the future I want to be in. Now Yamaha started working on hydrogen fueled performance engines five years ago. Takashi, who works at Yamaha's R&D department, said that hydrogen powered engines actually had very fun and easy to use characteristics. He also stated that hydrogen engines have an innately friendly feel that makes them easy to use, even without resorting to electronic driving aids. So they are fun, which is really good, but another part of what makes a great car is the sound, and apparently this thing sounds awesome. The Hydrogen's V8's 8 into one manifold is said to give off a harmonic high frequency exhaust note, so it's safe to say that I am excited to hear this thing for myself. If it sounds as good as they say, I might just book a ticket to Japan and go hug these guys. If you didn't know, I, I love internal combustion engines, and quiet electric cars really saddens me. Anyways, why hydrogen internal combustion engines? Well, Yamaha's motor president Yoshiro Akida said, Hydrogen engines house the potential to be carbon neutral while keeping our passion for the internal combustion engine alive at the same time. And I couldn't agree more. In my opinion, this is the answer and this is the future for all sports cars. But what do you think? Do you agree with me? Or do you like the quiet electric cars yes they've got instant torque and yes they deliver crazy straight line performance but they are very heavy and just boring i don't know yeah. yeah i know it's not boring when you're accelerating at that rate but like just driving and going around the track i think an internal combustion will always win but let me know down below what you think if, if you like this video please leave a like and subscribe to the youtube channel i've got many more videos just like this one um if you want to know more about how hydrogen internal combustions work um, the video on the GR Yaris, I spoke in depth on how it works. So go watch this that one after this one. Yeah, so I'll check you guys in the next one. Cheers, I. Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through the 
yeah. The pain I felt is pain.